Now let's practice a bit. As earlier mentioned, a common noun is a noun showing a class of objects or a concept as opposed to a particular individual. Now I want you to read the sentence, fruit and vegetables are good for you and underline these nouns. Fruits, vegetables are the nouns. Now again, common nouns are general names. They are not capitalized unless they begin a sentence or are part of a title. I want you to read this sentence, books can help you learn something, and underline these nouns. Books. Great. Now again, most of the time we add S to singular nouns to show more than one plural. What is the plural form of the word map? Maps. The word cake? Cakes. And if the singular form ends in S, 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 H, C, H, X, Z, or O, add E, S to make a plural. More than one. The word sandwich? Sandwiches. Cross? Crosses. Fox. Foxes. Tomato. Tomatoes. And if the singular noun ends in Y, again, change Y into I and add ES to make a plural. More than one. Try with the word here, lily. Lilies. And if the singular noun ends in F or FE, F is often changed into VE before adding S to make a plural. Try with the word wife. Wives. And calves? Calves. Okay, so some nouns do not follow any of the rules explained earlier. They are irregular. For example, a mouse is a small rodent. Try to make a plural in this following sentence. Mice can find their way into your house. 